What's going on guys, it's Morton here, and one of our friends, Triax, who I talked to on Twitter, was sent this photo by one of his friends who believes it is 100% genuine and real. So, me and Triax, and literally a bunch of other people, went on the search to find more information about this. So let's take a look at the photo and then we're gonna talk about it a little bit. So with debunking so much, we know what to look for in photos and videos and it makes it a lot quicker for us to determine if something is real or fake. And with debunking so much, we kinda you know knew what to do here. So I want you guys to go in the comment section below and let us know before, before I continue any farther, if you guys notice there's anything out of the ordinary about this photo, we wanna hear what you guys think down in the comment section below. And before you do that, make sure you like and subscribe if you're not already subscribed because every Monday I post new videos. Okay, the first thing that stands out about this photo is look how high the skull is. Even with this earthquake that supposedly happened in five different countries, and that's we found five different supposed locations. This earthquake, it, this photo is actually from a natural disaster, by the way. Um, but say this earthquake did happen that skull would still be like this far sticking up out of the ground. So every day people are walking on the skull, stepping on the skull, driving on the skull, and they don't notice. That's your first mistake right there, total mistake. Second mistake is if you look at the skulls, it's the same exact skull. Look at this photo right here, and this points out some of the same exact spots. I don't know if a lot of people know this, but human skulls are not identical. They're all different, people's teeth are all different, and magically these teeth and the exact breaks on this skull are in the same exact places. So it's the same exact skull, just uh, tweaked a little bit. Um, and we do have proof that you can match these skulls up and see it does fit. This was the magic work of Triax, something I couldn't magically do. That's just, that's too advanced computer editing wise for me. But there is that. We looked and there's like five different origins of where this supposedly happened. Uh, yeah, Mexico, Guatemala, Honduras, uh, I think there was, there was a couple other ones too. But anyway, so me and Triax, we did some massive searching on this thing to find the original photo. We didn't find the original photo, but we, what we did find is it came from a contest. And what's really funny is every other skull picture that has been sent to me as proof that Christianity is a true religion, every one of them has been from this exact same contest too make realistic looking giant skulls. As you can see, this is the website with the skulls that were all made. And if you look, that's the exact date that it was posted. And this is the actual guy that made the uh, photo. So people need to look into things before they count it as proof. All these people sending me these giant skull pictures, this just debunks every one of them. They were all for a contest. And there's actually one on this, this uh, there's one not on this list that I'm actually gonna do anyway that I really like. It's actually my favorite one isn't in this contest. So um, I hope you guys like that one too. But not human skulls, not real for a contest. Sorry guys. So all you people who believe these giant skulls are real and they're being found all around the world, do some research before you assume that they're real. Well, with that said, I hope you guys like the video. Share the video with your friends and subscribe. Every Monday I am posting new videos, so I hope to see you guys next time.